Good morning, welcome to day 17. Is it 17th today? Yeah, day 17. I'm just about to put up yesterday's vlog. Ooh, it didn't take me that long to edit it because it was very short. So that is ready if you guys haven't watched that already. It'll be linked in the description box. How many videos have we put up now? Quite a few. Ooh, I can't believe how quick this seems to be going. So it is quarter past 11. I start work at half past 12. So I'm just going to start getting ready. Matt is actually dropping me off this morning. So I don't have to think about like parking or anything. So it's going to make it a lot easier. So we don't have to leave till a little bit later on. Which is good. This morning I got up. I edited yesterday's vlog. Literally took me like half an hour to edit it. Which was really lovely. <laughs> just to not have to spend like two hours editing a video. I feel like I'm starting to get quicker now. Which is always is a bonus. Actually done that, just had a shower, popped my PJs back on. I always do this, I don't know why. Like, I don't like sitting in my uniform for ages. I find it really uncomfortable. And I'm just gonna get ready. I've had to put some socks on though, because my feet are frozen. We have these socks. I don't know where we got them from. I think we got them from, from the range, I think it was. And do you know the thermal socks? and they're like really thick and fluffy we got some of them matt got a black pair and i've got some like christmasy kind of looking ones i'll show you guys now let me just get some moisturizer on my hands they're literally the comfiest things ever so warm socks happy days so i am literally just getting ready for work i'm gonna pop a little bit of makeup on but not a lot just a little bit to kind of make me look a little bit more alive makeup is just gonna be what i did the other day so i'm just gonna fast forward this bit because we need to leave like pretty soon so I just put a really light layer of makeup on because I just wanted to look a bit more awake, but I couldn't be bothered like with a full face. I'm just going to go and finish getting ready, then I'm going to have to go to work and I'll catch up with you guys when I get home. This makeup has been on for 14 hours now, so it needs to come off. This is the Beauty Crop Avocado Cleansing Balm. I really like it. gonna make this very quick because I am shattered. It's half past 12 at night. I got home from work and had to, had to wash my uniform ready for tomorrow. Watch an episode of House and that's all I've done. I forgot to say yesterday. Sorry I'm whispering by the way. I think Matt is asleep already. I'm not sure. But yesterday I got home from work and someone had parked like over our space and the neighbour's space. And I was like, what an idiot, like parking over two spaces. Now usually if it's like a delivery driver, they will put their hazards on so you will like wait so you know they're gonna come back. And the hazards weren't on or anything. And I thought, what an idiot, like why? Would you park over two spaces that you can clearly see that you've parked over two spaces? So luckily the space next to us, no one really parks in it that often. So I thought, right, if I kind of block their space a little bit, they're not going to be bothered because no one usually parks there. I park there, like half over my space, half over the space to the other side of us that no one uses. By the way, it's annoying because I would have to park on the main road and it's quite a long walk because it's our space. Like, it's annoying. I got out of the car and I went to take a picture of, do you know like how the ca car would park? Because I thought if we get a parking ticket for parking over like the neighbour's space, you know, I want proof that I had to, like I couldn't not park like that. I went to take a picture of this person's car and then this young lad like walks up to me and he's got like a delivery bag and you could see he was like a bit annoyed because <laughs> obviously it, I was clearly taking a picture of his car I didn't actually get a picture of the car because he'd like come along because I was just about to take it and he was like I've parked like an 
and I was like, oh yeah, <laughs> no, no, it's all right. And then he was like, I'm going now. And I was like, okay. But you know, when you don't embarrass, because he literally caught me taking a picture of his car. Like, I hadn't took the picture, but I was going to take a picture. I was like, oh, let me move my car so you can get in. He's like, no, it's all right, I can get in. Do you feel like someone's being a bit passive aggressive? And I thought, mate, you could have put your hazards on, because then I would have just waited. But the amount of times we've had people park in our space, it's so annoying. I've stopped someone from parking in our space before. And it sounds really first world problems, but it is like annoying. Obviously, there's worse things going on in the world right now. Anyway, I feel like this vlog's gonna be super duper short. I'm so sorry. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye guys. <laughs>